So a huge well done to Blake for this week. His achievement and his progress made in his circuits and his training has been outstanding. Well done Blake. Well done to Liam and Billy. It was lovely to spend some time with you and see you enjoying yourselves and being so sensible this week. Well done boys. A special mention to Ryan. He's in school every day and is an absolute pleasure to spend time with. His manners are impeccable and everyone looks forward to seeing him every day. Well done, Ryan. Hi guys, just want to say well done to Jimmy and Kyle for taking part in the Key Stage 4 Live lesson today. Both of you really engaged and worked really hard um, in the lesson. And for Key Stage 3, well done to Jerry and Ryan. Both of you have produced some amazing pieces of writing using lots of language devices and it's been a pleasure to read. Well done. Well done to Kyle for joining in on his live maths lesson this week. He could definitely show Miss Toggle a thing or two about algebra and substitution. Keep it up. Science superstars. On laptops far, far away, three planets from the sun, sat intergalactic pupils learning about rocket science. Alexa, what was the largest and most powerful rocket and how big was it? A big shout out and well done to Jerry and Jacob for their science work they did last week. Another shout out for me this week for Billy who has come back to school and has had a really positive and good week and of course I can't give a shout out in an assembly without saying well done to Ryan for always turning up to school, giving it his best and just generally being a delight to have around. Well done, all four of you. Um, and I look forward to seeing more of you in school as a Monday. Well done to TJ for creating moulds from his family's body parts. You've shown commitment towards your art GCSE. And I'm looking forward to when you can return to school so we can use the moulds to cast the sculptures. And also, a big well done for Lily for coming into school to complete her stunning painting of a lily. This week's Key Stage 3 Home Learning Star of the Week is Rio. And Key Stage 4 Home Learning Star of the Week is Jimmy. Well done, guys. Keep up the good work. It's been lovely visiting you all on a Monday, handing over the enrichment packs. I thoroughly enjoy speaking to you and your families, hearing about what you've been up to. Take care and I look forward to seeing you all again on Monday. As you're probably aware by now, um, Sports Day will have to be cancelled this year. However, uh, all is not lost. In the PE department, we have now created the first ever Rowan's Virtual Sports Day. Okay, it's going to run for four weeks from the 15th of June to the 15th of July and you're all going to be added into a class on Google Classroom. Each week there'll be two new activities to take part in. Every entry will earn your house five points. If you win that activity, you gain an extra 10 points. If you complete all eight activities during the festival, you would earn another 10 points. If you upload a video of yourself completing the task, then again, you'll receive another five points. This isn't just for pupils, this is for staff as well. Keep safe, get competing, and let's let the best house win. Up the gladiators. Now it's time for this week's head to head challenge with Mr. Hake and Mr. Rayner in Song Association. Up first, Mr. Hake. First word, crazy. Crazy for you. Good. Second word, feel. Come on, feel the noise. Third word, dance. Nothing left to say but you just dance, dance, dance. Come on now, come Good on. Good word, nothing. Nothing's gonna change my love for you. Fifth word, love. It must be love. 
love, love. Oh, good, and that is time. And now, Mr. Rainer's turn. First word, crazy. I'm crazy you love that shit. Second word, feel. Feel. Yep. I feel like making love. Third word, dance. Dance? Yep. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> You've got to sing a song, Mr. Rayner. Ah, uh, dance. Uh, I don't know one. Ooh. Fourth word, nothing. Oh, and that's time. And the winner is Mr. Hayes. Dear parents, carers, pupils and our extended Rowans community, I'm sure you've seen in the news the shocking scenes in the USA following the tragic murder of George Floyd and the subsequent Black Lives Matter protests all over the world, including here in Medway. We have been inspired by our Difference Leader colleagues at Tom Marsh and New Improves to speak out. We've been inspired by so many who are demonstrating and sharing their stories and views on social media. As a school in a predominantly white area, we have a huge responsibility to ensure that children of all races recognise the importance of inclusion, diversity, fairness and tolerance. The curriculum we deliver and discussions we have carefully attempt to do this. We are constantly evolving this curriculum. We aim to educate children so they are able to make adjustments to their own actions which will break down and ultimately remove white privilege and build diverse, inclusive communities where differences are celebrated. We recognise that we have to look at ourselves carefully, look at our systems and processes to make sure we are not complicit in racism. It is not okay to say you don't see colour. It is not okay to aim to just not be racist. We must be anti-racist. We are here as a community to offer support and discussion. We stand side by side by our black, Asian and minority ethnic community. Many will feel hurt and angry and we stand with you in solidarity. You can contact us all in the usual ways and even use the help at the rowansap.co.uk email address to seek support and dialogue at this time. During this unusual period, the majority of you will have more opportunity than ever to talk to your children. Take this opportunity for an honest and open conversation. It will be much more impactful than retweeting a Black Lives Matter poster on Instagram or sharing the latest night video advert on Facebook. Your voices are powerful and they are needed. Not speaking out is racism. We will speak out and be open and confident without fear or prejudice. At the Rowans, we see the world through a wider lens and we commit to change. To change ourselves, change school policy and ultimately support change in and for the lives of our young people. It is not okay to say you don't see colour. It is not okay to aim to just not be racist. We must all be anti-racist. <laughs>